talking about? Wait! Okay now, from the beginning. Hit it, boy. I am the mighty. Shadowgun Wargames Hero Unveil, featuring Jet. Jet was never one to pick a fight, instead always relying on his speed and smarts. As a courier of highly sensitive materials, Jet always managed to complete his mission, even against overwhelming odds. Always on the move, never backing down, all should watch their backs when Jet is around in Wargames. Jet's primary weapon is the Gryphon Machine Pistol, an accurate rapid-fire handgun suitable for mid-range combat. Don't be fooled by its size though, because it offers a significant damage per bullet. The second weapon in Jet's arsenal is the Jabberwock Shotgun. It's extremely powerful and can help you get out of trouble if you find yourself in close-range combat with your enemies. Use it in combination with Jet's abilities to get behind an enemy's back and cause some serious damage. As Jet is quick on his feet and obsessed with time and speed, his abilities give you more mobility and different ways to outsmart or outrun your opponents. The first one is Blink. Jet immediately teleports a short distance in the direction he's looking. You can use this ability to chase your opponents as well as to outrun them. The Blink also works great with your second ability, Time Rift. Jet travels into an alternate timeline where he's invincible but can't see his opponents. This means you'll be able to get away from a fight or sneak around your enemies. Other players can still see a slightly visible trail behind you, so you have to be careful not to get spotted. Although Jet isn't the strongest in fights, he's definitely the fastest. Use this to your advantage. Why fight when you can just outsmart your enemies? Use your abilities to sneak through the whole map, steal the flag and get it safely to your base. With some skill and a tiny bit of luck, you won't even get noticed. You've taken the flag. Jet can be a bit harder to play and getting used to, but once you master his playstyle, his ability to flank enemies and quickly capture the flag makes him invaluable to your team. He is ready to help you to become a War Games champion once the game is released. If you want to play the game as soon as possible, visit ShadowgunWarGames.com. Hello and welcome to a Shadowgun War Games Hero and Veil, featuring Revenant. A member of an enslaved alien race, Revenant had to exchange a part of his soul in order to care for what he holds dear. This resilient cyborg full of rage and regret is now one of the most terrifying contestants Wargames has to offer. First say hello to Revenant's little friend, the Ravager Machine Gun. 
With its huge magazine size and decent rate of fire, it's an excellent tool for keeping your enemies at bay. Just shower your opponent's position with bullets while your teammates attack their flank or steal the flag. If you quickly need to dispatch a single opponent, the Zealot Kinetic Repeater is your go-to weapon. It might not pack a punch on par with the Ravager, however, thanks to its quick rate of fire, it truly shines when you find yourself facing a wounded opponent in close quarters combat. Revenant's Roar is best to be used against multiple targets. He sends a loud sonic roar in a 90 degree cone, slowing and disorienting all enemies hit. Once you land the ability, it will be really hard for your opponent to run away or to move at all. The best time to activate Revenant's Inner Rage is when things go from bad to worse. When activated, Revenant becomes bigger, faster and tougher. That way, if you find yourself outnumbered, you can still buy enough time for your team to make their way to you or even slaughter the opponents yourself. Out of all the heroes participating in war games, Revenant has the toughest skin. His sheer size draws in enemy fire, while his high health allows him to survive long enough for your teammates to flank and dispatch the opposing team, making him the ideal candidate for your team's front line. In exchange for his toughness, Revenant has the slowest movement speed. But if you find yourself in need of quickly covering a short distance, Inner Rage's speed boost will help you to safely reach your opponent's position and unleash hell. Team drop the flag. Revenant is ready to help you to become a War Games champion once the game is released. Hello and welcome to a Shadowgun War Games Hero and Veil, vale, featuring Willow. Willow became one of the galaxy's top snipers, and as such, she likes to keep her distance, both figuratively and literally. Cold as ice and lethal as fire, Willow will make everyone double-check before crossing any open space in war games. Willow's primary weapon is the Avenger sniper rifle, perfect for dealing massive amounts of damage from the back line while staying safe from your enemies. The rifle is semi-automatic, so you don't have to reload after every shot. If an opponent gets too close to you, it's time to bust out the Lynx SMG. This rapid-fire submachine gun will help you take care of any short to mid-range threat. Also consider switching to it when you don't have enough time to reload your rifle. Willow's abilities combine both defense and offense. The first one is Supercharge. Willow charges her weapons to deal even more damage. Use it to take down a hard-to-kill target or to quickly dispatch multiple enemies in your sights. Willow's second ability is the Flash Mine. She deploys a mine that will temporarily blind any opponent that steps on it. If an enemy is chasing you, activate the mine, find a good position and then use your enemy's confusion to your advantage. Or deploy the mine in a close-range fight instantly blinding the enemy and assuring your victory. For Willow, it's crucial to keep a distance from her enemies as she has a lower amount of health. Always try to find a vantage point where you'll remain safe and see your enemy well. If you get into close combat, you'll probably want to disengage as soon as possible. The flash mine can help with that. And if you feel like fighting your way out, the SMG is probably a better weapon to use instead of trying to no-scope your opponent. Willow's damage output is very high, but once you get caught, you're gonna have a hard time, so always look out for your surroundings. Willow is a perfect choice for everyone who favors long-distance combat and has great aim. She is ready to help you to become a War Games champion once the game is released. Hello and welcome to a Shadowgun War Games Hero Unveil, featuring Sarah. Sarah is a third-generation sentient android robotic assistant, formerly used by the Planetary Federation and later hired by Slade as his first mate. Although her main function is to assist her allies, she is still a force to be reckoned with in war games. Sarah's primary weapon is the Asclepius rocket launcher. It's perfect for supporting your team in large-scale teamfights as its projectiles deal area effect damage between multiple opponents. Just try to keep your enemies at mid-range and be careful not to harm yourself when engaging targets too close to you. If you get into close combat or run out of rockets, your second choice is the Apioni SMG. It deals only medium damage, but is still a good choice to help your team push back the enemy or defend yourself against closer targets. Both of Sarah's abilities are designed to assist you and your team. 
The first one is the Healing Blast. Sarah throws a grenade that will rapidly heal every ally hero near the explosion, including you. A well-placed Healing Blast can change the outcome of any encounter, so be sure to pick the correct time and place carefully. Sarah's second ability is the Protection Dome. Sarah sets up a big shielding dome around her, absorbing any damage from the outside, for a limited time. The dome also has limited durability and will break after being under fire for a while. You can count on Sarah to provide healing and protection in any scenario, but also deal substantial damage to the enemy team. Her rocket launcher enables her to hit multiple targets at once, making her a terrifying presence in tight teamfights, while her rapid-fire SMG can finish off any wounded opponents. If you ever find yourself losing a fight, use the Protection Dome in conjunction with the Healing Blast. Simply place the dome around your team and heal everyone inside. Be careful not to deploy the Protection Dome too close to the enemy as they can run inside and negate its effect. Sarah combines both defensive and offensive capabilities in a slick metal frame. She is ready to help you and your team to become War Games champions once the game is released. If you want to play the game... Hello and welcome to a Shadowgun War Games Hero Unveil, featuring John Slade. Slade is an ex-Marine and a Shadowgun, an interstellar gun for hire. He's not just the most well-known character of the Shadowgun universe, but also one of the deadliest heroes in War Games. His primary weapon is a very accurate assault rifle. It performs well in mid-range to long distances and deals a fair amount of damage. Keep the enemy in your sights and unleash a hail of bullets. If you run out of ammo, consider switching to Slate's secondary weapon, a high fire rate SMG. It maybe doesn't hit as hard as the assault rifle, but switching weapons is always faster than reloading. Now, let's have a look at Slate's abilities. The first one being a high explosive grenade. Slate throws a grenade at a desired location, dealing a large amount of damage to one or multiple targets. A well-placed grenade can change the outcome of any team fight into your favor. Slate's second ability is Regeneration. Slate regenerates a moderate amount of his HP over time, preparing himself for the next fight. This ability grants Slate a high level of endurance, making him very strong even when not accompanied by a healer. As Slate, it's always important to find good cover to get some of your HP back. Of course, regeneration can also be used in the middle of combat, helping Slate to survive almost any tough fight. Slade excels in the front line, as he is capable of outperforming most of his enemies in overall damage. With only a moderate amount of maximum HP, your best bet is to always be close to cover and heal yourself between firefights. Cover is essential, since regeneration works over time and most enemies will kill you faster than you can heal. On that note, you really should watch out for snipers, as they are your greatest weakness. When throwing a grenade, the more targets you hit, the better. Try engaging groups of enemies low on HP and finishing them off with one blast. Alternatively, you can disengage, regenerate your health and resume the fight before your enemies have a chance to heal. Slade is ready to help you become a War Games champion once the game is released.